Yo, what's going on YouTube? This is Infant bringing you guys a brand new video. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the newest game for Naruto Storm 4, showing off the free roam story mode. Now, this is something that people were kind of skeptical about, like, basically, I would say. Uh, because for me, it's 50-50. Now, basically, it off the scan, it looks like the same slow-ass free roam that we've had in every single game. Naruto still runs really slow. They've had this in Storm 2, Storm Revolution, and, you know, Storm 3, and I really hope they really revamp it. They also said there's going to be special sequences or, you know, chats between, you know, partners because you're able to bring partners just like you were able to in Storm 3. You can bring them on missions, so you don't constantly have to use Naruto, which it has a good taste, but honestly, it feels like a repeat. I really hope this has a better open world than um, how Storm 3, Storm 2, and Revolution did because, you know, Storm 1 had probably the best free roam because you were able to jump on top of buildings and stuff like that. Also, we have the return of side missions. Honestly, I'm not the biggest person for Naruto side missions. I'll do them if I get bored, but it's not something that I really, really want to do. Now, it also seems like they might possibly be bringing back the customization of the characters, like adding on equipment. Maybe be cool if they could also, you know, change the color of your costume and stuff. I think that'd be pretty cool too. But it looks like by doing side missions, you can get special items and stuff like that, as you can see by the screenshot. Now moving on, they've actually talked about something kinda that I'm not too sure about. Now it says enhanced online mode, which really puts me on the fence because it honestly looks like the same thing as what Revolution had, you know, whenever you battle an opponent, then an AI comes up and wants to battle you. I don't know the name 100% at the moment because I haven't played Revolution in forever, but if you guys know it, leave in the comments down below. But the thing is, it then looks like a revamp, revamp version. This is gonna be multiple new online modes. So I really hope there's something really good that's coming out because like I said, there has to be some new features to really increase the longevity of this game. Just basically on the screenshot, I'm not too thrilled. Next we have Naruto Storm 4 DLC confirmed. Maybe, maybe CC2, Namco Bandai are actually watching our videos, watching my video and saying, oh, these are pretty good suggestions. Hopefully they give us like new maps new costumes, new jutsus, new characters, hopefully new characters because I know everyone wants these new characters to really increase the roster of the game because I mean we play with the same characters but I'm not going to rant right now, I'm not going to rant, I'm simply just going to tell you guys what the scan is about. Last but not least, we have something that I noticed that I didn't hear anybody else notice on their you know, review of the scan. Now if you guys notice that this Naruto has bandages over his hands, so this takes place after the war. So this could possibly mean a new Naruto, because you know, there's more Sasuke than Naruto, so maybe this is another Naruto, War Naruto in his base form, maybe he has new combos, who knows. But guys, leave some comments down below, let me, let me know what you guys think, and I'll you know, thank you guys for watching, comment, like, subscribe, and Infamous, out.